नमस्ते वेलकम टू दी इफेक्टिव पारायण ऑफ ग्रंथास थ्रू द नॉलेज ऑफ संदीस क्लास टुडे वी विल बी सीइंग द समरी ऑफ द व्यंजन संदीस एंड देन वी विल सी द ऑर्डर ऑफ व्यंजन संदीस सो एट द एंड ऑफ दिस लेसन वी विल बी एबल टू लर्न द समरी that is all the rules consolidated at one place so firstly vyanjana sandhis can be understood by dividing vyanjana sandhis into four parts the first part is therein the purva varna or para varna can be interchanged that is there is no fixed rule for the purva varna that is so and so should be the purva varna or so and so should be the para varna such a rule is not present in few cases so this is the first type in the second type you get the adesha in the place of purva varna that is purva varna is fixed para varna is fixed and we get the adesha in place of purva varna the third is we get the adesha in place of para varna and the fourth one is there is no adesha but there is agama so like this there are four ways of understanding vyanjana sandhis so in this first table we will be seeing the first type that is purvasya parasya va स्थाने आदेश हर इन दिस टेबल देर आर टू संधी वन इज स्टुत्त संधि द अदर इज स्टुत्त संधि सो इन स्टुत्त संधि वॉट अकर् इज इफ वी हेव सकार आर् चवर्ग लेटर्स इन कॉन्टैक्ट विथ शकार आर् चवर्ग लेटर्स then in place of sakara and tavarga we get shakara and tavarga as the adesha so udaharanam tacha tatacha tacha iti drishta in the stutta sandhi we saw that if sakara and tavarga comes in contact with shakara murdhanya prakara and tavarga then we get the adesha shakara and tavarga in place of sakara and tavarga so brihat tika tattankana ityade tasya udaharana now coming to the second table yatra purvasya sthane nama purva varnasya sthane adesha bhavati so in this the first sandhi is jashtva so in jashta sandhi what happens is in the purva varna should be a vargiya vyanjana except the fifth letters the para varna should be a swara or bhuja vyanjana then we get the adesha varga tritiya that is the third letter of vargiya vyanjanas that is j b g d d so the udaharanam is tat api tad api tad api so and regarding this sandhi we also saw that this only occurs at the end of pada padante eva ayam sandhi bhavati and also though we are telling paravarna should be aswara or rudivanchana actually jashta sandhi need not have paravarna at all without the nimitta without any condition of paravarna we can do the jashta sandhi the second sandhi is chatta sandhi wherein we have vargiya vyanjana on the left hand side on the right hand side we have karkasha vyanjana and in place of tiya vidana we get the adesha first letter of each varga 
उदाहरण यदल यदल पूर्व भवती तदनतर चर्त क्रीयते चेत यदल सो इन दिस्सि दिस्सि चर्त सन्धि इज निध्य सन्धि बट इफ वी हाव a word having uh, uh, conditions of chatta sandhi but if there is no other word following then we can get a uh, 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 we can get the chatta sandhi optionally for example we can either tell tat or we can tell tad this also we have seen in chatta sandhi नेक्स्ट इन अनुनासिक संधि नेक्स्ट संधि अनुनासिक संधि इन अनुनासिक संधि दि पूर्ववर्ण शुड बी वर्गीय व्यंजन दि परवर्ण शुड बी वन ऑफ दि वर्ग पंचम लेटर्स दट इज मन ऑफ दीज लेटर्स देन वी गेट दि आदेश फिफ्थ लेटर दट इज the fifth letter of the pura varna whichever is the pura varna its its fifth letter will come as the adesha in place of pura varna itself so the udaharanam is tat na or tat na tanna iti bhavati again this sandhi appears only at the end of a pada punascha अयम संधि अनुनासिक संधि विकल इट इज ऑप्शनल वी कैन इधर टेल तन्ना और वी कैन ऑप्ट नॉट टू डू दी अनुनासिक संधि इन जस्ट टेल तद न तद न दी नेक्स्ट संधि इज सप्त संधि इन सप्त पूर्ववर्ण शुड बी अ नकार परवर्ण शुड बी वन अमांग दी चाचा डैड है तथ वन अमांग दी स्लेटर्स देन वी गेट दी आदेश सकारा इन प्लेस ऑफ नकारा एंड दी स्वरा विच इज प्रिसीडेड विच इज नेक्स्ट टू दी सकारा सकारा आदेश विल गेट अनुस्वारा और इस रिप्लेस्ड बाय अनु तत्र सानुनासिक स्वर सो एग्जांपल इज तांस तथा तान तथा इति पूर्वम भवति नकारस्य स्थाने सकारादेशः पुनश्च सकारात् पूर्वम आकारः वर्तते तस्य अनुस्वारागमः भवति वा तत्र सानुनासिक आदेशः भवति अतः तांस तथा और तांस तथा इति फॉर्म so this occurs at the end of the pada and once satva is done if there is chance of chutva and stutva that is if the paravarna is cha cha or da da then we have to do stutva and stutva also so next sandhi is the special case of satva sandhi wherein we have makara on the left hand side which is the ending letter of the upasarga sam and on the para Uh, on the right hand side we have skru skru dhatu having sakara at the starting then we get the adesha sakara adesha in place of makara and similar to the uh, satta rule here also the swara which is beside the makara will get uh, anuswara or is replaced by anunasika swara so example is sanskritam or sanskritam so next sandhi which is our is parasavarna sandhi in parasavarna sandhi pura varna should either be one of the tavarga letters and on the right hand side that is the paravarna should be l that is lakara then we get the adesha l 
So we get Adesha Lakara in place of Thu Thu Du Thu. We get Sanunasika Lakara in place of Nakara. So Udharanam Tallajaha. Tadu Lajaha Tallajaha Iti Bhavati. Next, in Parasamarana there was another rule wherein on the left hand side we have Anuswara, on the right hand side we have Vyanjana, except the Ushma, Ushmana letters, that is, except Shaya, Shaya, Saha, if you have Vargiya, uh, if you have Vyanjana on the right hand side, then we get the Adesha, Varga Panchama as the Adesha, that is the fifth letter of each Varga. And if the Vyanjana is Ya, Le, Va on the right hand side, we get the Adesha Sanunasika Yakara, Sanunasika Lakara, Sanunasika Vakara. So the Udaharanam is Param Dhimahi, Param, Param Anuswara, and Dhimahi. It gives the form Param Dhimahi. The Nakara is the fifth letter of the Tavarga. So we are getting that Adesha. So it is Parandhimahi, an example of Parasavarna. So here also we saw this Parasavarna is of two types. That is, one is Nitya, one is Vikalpa. The mandatory Parasavarna occurs within a word. We also saw the examples like Shankita, Shamkita, Nandati, Namdati, etc. So in such cases, the Sandhi is mandatory. The Parasavarna Sandhi is mandatory. When we have uh, Aruswara at the end of a Pada, then there is an option of doing the Sandhi. So if we want, we can do the Sandhi or else we can choose not to. So this was Parasavarna. Next is Anuswara Sandhi. In Anuswara again, there was uh, there are two rules. The first rule tells about the Makara being converted into Anuswara when the Paravarana is Vyanjana. That is, the Makara should be at the end of a Pada. Padante Eva Ayam Niyavaha. When the Makara is at the end of a Pada, which is followed by a Vyanjana, then the Makara is replaced by Anuswara. Udharanam tam sarvam tam iti makaraha bhavati makara sasthane anusvaraha adeshaha bhavati tam sarvam iti rupam siddhati. The other rule in anusvara is apadanta anusvara sandhi. That is, vitina pada anusvara akars. That is, on the left hand side, we should have makara or nakara. On the right hand side, if we have Yenjana except the fifth letters and Antastha. Antastha is Yara Lava. Except these letters, if any Yenjana is present on the right hand side, then we get the Adesha Anuswara. Anuswara Adesha Havati in place of Makara or Nakara. So, the example is Yashamsi. So, before it was Yashan Si. Nakara was there. In place of Nakara, we are getting Anuswara by this Sandhi. So the difference between these two Sandhi rules, that is Anuswara Sandhi rules, are one occurs only at the end of Pada, one occurs only within a Pada. So next type of Vyanjana Sandhi, which we saw, was wherein we get the Adesha in place of Paravarana. So here the first Sandhi is Purva Savarna Sandhi. In Purva Savarna, we saw again two rules predominantly. The first rule states that if the Purva Varna is Varga Tritiya, that is third letter of a Varga, and if the Paravarna is Hakara, then we get the Adesha Varga Chaturtha, that is the fourth letter of the Varga, in place of Hakara. So, Hakara is replaced with the fourth letter of that word. Udaharanam, Tadu Ajaha, Tadu Ajaha iti pravati, Tasmin Prasange, Tadu Dhajaha, Tadu Dhajaha. 
सन्धि तय अयमी सन्धि विकल विकल बट इज वी कैन ईदर टेल तर वी कैन नाट डू दि सन्धि So in pura savarna we saw another rule. Therein we have takara on the left hand side. The takara should be uh, the upasarga. Uh, the takara should be the ending letter of the upasarga uthe. And paravarna, if the paravarna is sakara, which is the starting letter of the dhatus stha or stamp, then we get the adesha th takara in place of sakara. So we get the rupa utthana. Since this is difficult, we also have an optional uh, deleting option. That is, the takara desha, which has come in place of sakara, can optionally be deleted. So we also get the form utthana. So in uh, chatta sandhi, next sandhi is chatta sandhi. In chatta sandhi. Puravarna should be the first letters of a varga. The Paravarna should be Shakara. Then we get the Adesha Shakara in place of Shakara. Udaranam uh, Vak Charei Vak Charei Vak Charei Eki Bhagavati. So this Sanji also occurs only at the end of a pada. And this sanji is optional, so we get the form vak charai hi also. Optionally, if we don't want to do chhatta sanji, then we can do vak charai hi also. Next, we saw two agama sanjis in the jana, and in the sanjis, one is namuda agama sanji, the second is tuga agama sanji. So in Namuda Agama Sandhi, Purva Varna should be N, 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 one of these three, which should be beside a Rasaswara. So on the left hand side, you should have Rasaswara and one among the N, N, N letters. And on the right hand side, if you have any Swara, then We get the agama ne ne ne, which comes in between the purvarna and paravarna. So the udaharana is the channa bi, the channe abi, the channa bi is the final uh, form. So this sandhi is mitya sandhi. There is no option of not doing this sanji, and this occurs only at the end of the pada. Pada am jayeva ayam sanji. So the next agama sanji which we saw was tuga agama sanji. Therein there are again two rules. One rule is nitya, the other rule is vikalpa. So one rule is mandatory, the other rule is option. So when does the mandatory to gagama occur? Is when we have pura varna as prasasvara. When we uh, and if we have para varna as chakara, then the <coughs> takara takara gagama occurs nitya. That is mandatory. So the example is vriksha chaya. We get the tuga gama santhi, vrikshati chaya. Then we have to do chutta santhi. So we will get vrikshat chaya, vrikshat chaya. So next, uh, in the other rule of tuga gama, we saw that if we have puravarna as dirgha swara, and if we have chakara on the right hand side. Then we get the agama, the which comes in between purva and paravata. So the agama is te chinnaha. 
since this is an optional sanchi, if we don't want to do the sanchi, then we enter te chinnaha also. Again, this sanchi occurs only at the end of a pada. And another thing to notice, once tugagama occurs, chutta sanchi will definitely occur. Tugagama is followed by chutta sanchi. This is one thing which we have to keep in our minds. So with this, the summary of the Indian is done.